Hello everybody, Mrs Young here, welcoming you to another assembly here at Ibrox Primary and Nursery class. It's the 1st of February today, can't believe it, January's done and dusted and we're in the second month of the year, Fe uh, January rather, seems to have just flown in. So today's assembly, quite exciting, I've got a couple of competition winners to share with you. We've got the thank you card competition that uh, everybody is waiting to hear who has won and we've also got where is Mrs Y competition winner from last week. I've got a little bit of an update on an exciting new thing that's going to be starting this Tuesday here at Ibrox um, and I'm looking forward to telling you a bit more about that. I've had a really nice week last week where we tried to um, meet up in classes via Teams now it's all new to everybody, so it's, it's been a wee bit tricky kind of getting it going, but we did manage to see some people at home and that was really lovely. Uh, we're going to try again this week, so keep your eye out on your Glow email addresses, boys and girls, because you will get an invite to a Teams meeting with myself and your teacher and all the classmates that can join in, so keep a wee look out for that. Okay, so we'll get on. First up, uh, this the assembly is going to be our birthdays. Birthdays from January, because you remember last week I told you that we were trying to catch up on birthday certificates. So we're nearly caught up and today I'm going to announce all the January birthday, um, people who'd had birthdays in January for um, the, the month. Don't forget, if it's your birthday in January and I read out your name, you need to look out for Badger Mail because you will get your birthday certificate sent to you and your other birthday certificate will get put into your achievement folder in school, okay? So, our January birthdays, starting with the nursery. Halima, happy birthday to you for the 26th of January. And Mohammed Rizwan, your birthday the 7th of January. That's primary one, two. And we've also got Barira and Zainab, who also celebrated birthdays in January from primary one, two. Um, Sadil in primary two. So you're in prim the primary one, two class. So well done and big happy birthday to you. Samuel in primary three. Sufian in primary four. Daniel in primary five. Daniel Gill. Uh, Alan Donald in primary six and then lots of primary seven celebrating their birthday in January. We've got um, Jay Allen, Aisha Bana, Callum Black, Aman Singh, Jason Singh and Jay Ali Touring Boy all celebrating birthdays in January. So a big happy birthday to all of you who celebrated in January. I hope you all had a, a great time celebrating as best you can during the current circumstances. Now I would like to tell you all about um, a new initiative, a new project that we're going to be starting here at Ibrox Primary and Nursery class. This is a little project that is um, a team effort. So we've got the school are involved with the school staff and the nursery are involved with their staff and the parent council are also involved. So it's really lovely that we've all come together and we're going to start this. This is going to happen on Tuesday. Um, at different time slots. It's called the Badger's Pantry and you will be able to come along this Tuesday and collect a pack and in your pack will be ingredients to make a soup. So you'll be able to go home and enjoy making soup together um, as a family and then enjoy eating it and we would like you to tweet some pictures of that. If you come along to get a soup pack on Tuesday, there'll also be some other things there that you can you can get. There's going to be some stationery if people are needing that. There's going to be some toiletries, um, things maybe items if you have a baby. There's also going to be that, um, as well as some uh, games and jigsaws. So if you're looking for a little activity to do at home as a family, you would be able to get that. So on Tuesday, the time slots are 9:15 to 10:15. 11 to 12 and half one till half two and this poster here says that they're the times that you can come down you don't need to book you can just come down um, and collect your soup pack and then anything else that you feel that you need okay and this poster here this is also on the app and we've put it on twitter if you're unsure of anything you can even you can give the school a phone or you can email me at the head teacher uh, email address 
Next, I am delighted to share with you our thank you card competition winner. So we've got a runner up and then we've got the winner and the winning entry will be made into cards, uh, made at a printing uh, company. They'll do that for us and make it into cards and we'll be able to use them um, as and when we need them. Uh, and this it was a very difficult decision and I have to say, because it was a difficult decision, I delegated it to be made by somebody else. So Mr Dolan, Miss Telford and Miss New, they all came together, they looked at all of the entries and they came to a decision. Uh, and as I say, I don't think it was an easy one because the standard was really, really high. What we've done with all the entries is we have backed them onto a black cardboard and we're going to make a display in the school of all the thank you card entries. So maybe ne next time at assembly, I can maybe, uh, maybe actually do the assembly in front of that display um, and we'll put a picture on Twitter so you can all see the fabulous entries that we, we received. A big thank you to everybody that did enter. Um, really high quality. The, the standard of the entries and as I say it was a tough tough decision so I, I wish and I had some children here to do our famous Ibrooks drum roll can do, I don't feel I can do it myself so in second place with a fantastic entry was Kai and that was his entry there yeah so a fantastic effort there and that was runner up so I'll send you a certificate as a runner up and the winning entry goes to Kaylinor there we go that's his entry there and we've got pictures without the name on the front so that that uh, winning entry can get made into a card. And Kaylin, you will get a copy for your family of the card when it is made. So a big well done to you and thank you, as I say, to everybody for entering. But big well done to Kaylin for having the winning entry. Last bit then of today's assembly is the Where is Mrs Y? So we'll start off um, with the competition uh, entries from last week. So it was, where is Mrs. Y? And all these entries in this hat were able to guess correctly that I was outside my office. And I feel that it was a bit easy because I had signs and things that said that it was outside my office. So I've tried this week to make it a wee bit trickier. There'll be certain children in the school that maybe know this space better than others, but we will see, because maybe brothers and sisters might help out. Um, and remember, if you're tweeting an entry for where you think I am this week, remember to use this hashtag. So, winning entry from last week. Let's see. Okay. So, the winner is Abby McEwen in Primary 1-2. And she shared her guess with me at the gate one day, shouting through the gate to tell me where she thought I was. So big well done, Abby. And remember, look out for Badger Mail where your prize um, and certificate will be sent. And as I say, we remind it again, everybody, where is Mrs. Y a hashtag if you are tweeting your answer? If not, you can email it to me or if you're in the school um, coming even for maybe the um, Badger's Pantry on Tuesday, you could tell me, okay? Right, Team Ibrooks, have a fantastic week. Again, remember, look out on those Glow um, email addresses for a Teams meeting. Hopefully, we'll get more of each class on. And also, Shobi uh, is starting to happen um, with classes as well. And I'm really excited. The teachers are telling me um, about the children that are joining and the bits and pieces that are going, is going on there already happening very quickly. So, big well done. Big well, one, one, big well done to everyone, children staff and parents. Okay, you're doing a marvellous job. Right, take care everybody. Bye-bye.